Hi, I'm Tam. And I'm Bobby. And welcome to our adventures. Morning, it's day 65. Welcome Los Angeles. The first of five sea days as we make our way over to Hilo, Hawaii on Big Island. Here. We'll go to Hilo and then we'll swing around to Kona. And then we'll go over to Oahu and spend an overnight in Honolulu. So that's like the next week or so for us. And uh, it should be a relaxing voyage. There's some enrichment talks. Probably going to do some editing. Miss some people. Miss some people. A lot of people that got off. Some are coming back on. Fortunately, others we will hopefully see again one day. We know we will meet up with Nadine in Auckland. But with Gabby's gone. Uh, so our parents will be back on in a little bit. There. And um, yeah. Please have me welcome to the stage. Let's turn on mine. All right. No, I, I'm truly honored and grateful just to be here. Uh, as Grace mentioned, my name is Mike Scheibel, and I'm the founder of Travel, meaning a travel storytelling community, interviewing extraordinary people to hear their travel stories that have impacted their lives in their careers. I have people like Grammy winning musician Jason Mraz or TV personality Phil Rosenthal, celebrity chef Eric Ajapan, all tell me their deep, dark, really inspiring travel stories. I'm also the host, as I mentioned, of a podcast. And see, I believe that travel is this thing that bonds us all. It connects us. It brings us together. Travel is the only thing you buy that makes you richer. And I would imagine some of you are here because of that. I'm not really saying monetarily. However, some of the greatest companies in the world, like Starbucks or Lyft, all have been created because of travel experiences. What we're gonna be doing over the next couple of days, today is gonna to be an introduction. How many people, show of hands, how many people are here because the title Travel of meaning and how to travel of meaning sort of sparked your curiosity. Okay, great. That's fantastic. Me too. Travelers, I believe, strangers are just people you haven't met yet. So here's what I would really love for you to do. I know this might be a little weird, but I would love for you to turn to somebody you don't know. Introduce yourself. Find out where they're from. And find out one place they're excited to visit on this leg of the cruise. Just take a few moments. Just introduce yourselves. We'll go from there. Good evening, Saturday night. In concert with a voice of the This next song, we're going to take you guys way, way back to Plastic Drop. That's right. You got to take a guitar lesson in there. Why don't you know that one riff right there? That riff is smoke on the wall. We're going to keep some purple for this. We got to go out to my soul. The lady is so Have we got any Rolling Stones fans in the house? <laughs> you ain't bad. I'm 
Goodbye, Norma Jean. Though I never knew you at all, you had the grace to hold yourself when those around you crawled. They crawled out of the woodwork and they whispered into your brain. They said you on a treadmill and they made you change your name. It seems to me you lived your life like a candle in the wind, never knowing who to cling to when the rain set in. Good morning, day 66, day two of five sea days in Hawaii. And uh, that's another relaxing day. We went and saw the show last night. It was really good. We went to the LGBTQ meetup, but we were up late. So we barely made it to breakfast. It's 10.17. Breakfast closes at 10.30, I think. 11. Maybe 11, maybe 10.30. I don't know. I'll have to check. It might be 11. Maybe we had a little time. I wasn't as stressed as I was. They closed half the wind jam already, so they're prepping for lunch. So, yeah. So another relaxing sea day. Nothing better to do here on the world cruise, right? So everybody, if you are ready for it, please put your hands together and make some noise for Mike Shaibo. Thank you so much. Can you guys hear me okay? Yeah. Fantastic. Thank you guys all so much for coming out today. The sun is shining. I was, I was like, I don't know if anyone's going to show up. So thank you for being here. My name is Mike Shaibo, and I am the founder of Travel Meaning, the host of the Traveled Meeting Podcast. Let's start the show today. Good morning, it's day 67. Another sea day, it's our third sea day out of Los Angeles. We got two more until we get to Hilo, Hawaii. It's a beautiful day, it's a little sunny. Sunny over there, so we're sitting over here in the shade, but uh, we're having a Richmond talk today and just kind of have a nice, relaxing day. I'm guessing it's a Valentine's Day thing coming up later today. The Bible. <laughs> I will admit that that's that not absolutely one of the uh, most unique ways someone's ever pronounced their last name. So I feel pretty honored. Thank you, Kat. Let's start today's show. My name is Mike Shadow, I'm the founder of Travel with Me. This is where we come together as a community of life and travel. Good morning, it's day 68. We have another sea day. We've got uh, today's Thursday, Friday's a sea day, and then we'll be in Hilo. We got up 9 a.m. for a town hall on visas, and tomorrow we'll have another town hall at 9 a.m. to talk about the itinerary. So it's a beautiful day. Can't complain. We're having breakfast because that's what we do. I just wanted to make sure that we are all aware that today's presentation is to talk about visas that are applicable for segment two. So from now until Dubai. This is not the itinerary update that some of you might be waiting for. So, welcome to morning. I hope you're ready for an 87-day wonderful adventure on this magnificent 
Magnificent. Okay, but travel with meaning. So please, everybody, welcome Mike Scheibel, everyone. Not surprised. Thank you so very much. Appreciate it. I have to tell you that these last several days, in introducing the concept of how to travel with meaning and the principles of how to travel with meaning. The response I've been getting from travelers on board has just really been blowing me away. People wanting to stop and tell me travel stories or share how some of these conversations have just started to spark some nostalgia and looking at maybe your past trips or where you are currently right now in the moment. So just deep gratitude for all that. Um, I know Trent and I got into a really wonderful conversation last night and I just thank you all so much for just accepting this and looking at this. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Julian Mendoza. Goodbye, Joe. You gotta go, me Ohio. Me gotta go, poor people down the bio. I will be singing a song by the infamous Richie Valens. So, I grew up in a little town called Phoenix, Arizona. Brought, uh, two amazing people brought me up. My parents are right there. It's their first time here, buddy. It's the ultimate world tour. Can you believe that? Oh. 